cubes and their prime factors. Let us learn how to check whether the given number is a perfect cube or not. We can find this out by prime factorization of the given number. Let us do some prime factorizations. 4 cube is equal to 64 is equal to 2 multiplied by 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 2 is equal to 2 cube multiplied by 2 cube. 6 cube is equal to 216 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 is equal to 2 cube multiplied by 3 cube. 12 cube is equal to 1 7 2 8 is equal to 2 multiplied by 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 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 is equal to 2 cube multiplied by 2 cube multiplied by 3 cube. From the above examples we can observe that in prime factorization every prime number is present in groups of 3. Therefore in a perfect cube every prime factor will be present in groups of 3. Let us do some examples for better understanding. Find out whether the following numbers are perfect cubes or not. Remember the rule. In the prime factorization of a number, if every factor is in groups of 3, then that number is a perfect cube. 1.2744 Answer. Prime factorization of 2744 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 7 multiplied by 7 multiplied by 7. In the prime factorization of 2744, both 2 and 7 are present 3 times. Therefore, 2744 is a perfect cube. 400. 400 is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 5. In the prime factorization of 400, both 2 and 5 are not present 3 times. Thus, 400 is not a perfect cube.